Om Jai and welcome back to my channel and this will be a quick energy update for Twin Flames for 26-5 Blood Moon Energy. So 26-5 Blood Moon Energy, what I suggest to Twin Flames to do is drink a lot of lot of lot of water, more than you usually drink and be ready for a lot of shifts to happen in a much faster rate. So a lot of things that you've been manifesting, a lot of things that you've been waiting for to come in front of you and a lot of revelations that you've been waiting for that is finally going to come in front of you. Your spiritual insights, your spiritual truth will be reflecting on the physical front. Whatever is hidden for a long time, the truth that has been hidden for a long time, that truth will be out there and revealed. More to that, you are getting into a vortex, getting into a state of consciousness where your 3D and 5D are coming into a state of equilibrium. There's no more running away from the fact that it is all happening. It's finally coming into a state of knowing, like you know it. And anyway, you are in the process at this point of time. To move to that, you are actually in that procedure and proceeding and that phase is already that has shuffled in at that at this point of time based on where you are at this point in your twin flame journey. So you already almost know, but then there are certain layers to integrate and for you to just know, know certain things. So if you're manifesting something or there is something, you just have to just know. So there's just some more layers that is going to heighten the journey and suddenly you just can just believe in what you're just trying hard so much to believe in. Probably it's like... You probably are having a half time to believe in something you just will know and living in the end you just get into a vortex where strongly with your intentions your feelings are going to get really 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 more conscious you'll get more conscious of your being and it's definitely time to be you, you who you truly are be yourself about like being who you truly are from within so within and without being the same person, it's about coming into that dimension. And finally, it's the time to just fearlessly just to be yourself without caring about who's thinking what, but to just put yourself first, just listen to your priority, just not get into anything unnecessarily, just not get into any kind of conflict unnecessarily just not get yourself into any type of controversy unnecessarily just be sorted with yourself just be sorted in your own zone just be sorted with your own consciousness and anything that you're just getting a vibe of like okay this is not good for me that is not good for me and all this while maybe it was like you wouldn't be sure that is it like really good for me or maybe it is good for me maybe it is not good for me that confusion will be gone completely it will like completely be strained out and you'll be like sure okay this is not good for me this i'm not doing like learning to say no but initially you may have like some kind of guilt to say no but then finally after tomorrow the blood moon energy will be taking away the guilt because a lot of revelations are going to get obvious people's dualistic faces will be right in front of you people who have been like pretending to be something else but are something else those truth are going to be revealed to you on a more traitor level with that revelation taking place finally getting into a lot of assurance and surety you'll be seeing past the bullshit and as you see past the bullshit, you'll be much more conscious of yourself and do not fall into a trap of people of what people are thinking and deciding for what you should be doing. It's their perspective. And if it's their perspective, this is my perspective. I'm not going to get intimidated by somebody else's perspective. 
and I'm gonna stick to what I am. This is who I am, and I don't care who thinks what. This I don't care part has been a bit dancing and shaky, and that is going to get a firm foundation after tomorrow. That's also something else that's coming in. That's the YouTube to surprise for the twin flames, of course. Like, and foundation is needed, otherwise the tilty feeling is like not good. So these are some of the magical shifts coming in. Ascension frequency will heighten its consciousness and three-dimensional reality to become the five-dimensional reality. The energy is accelerating in a heightened process and the magic is swelling in and also expect communication. Thank you, love and light to you. Namaste. Have a great day to know more about me and to work with me. In the description box below, you'll find all the details.